Hey fire signs, how's it going? How are you guys doing? I hope you guys are doing fantastic. If this is your first time checking out Chula Divine's channel, what is up guys? My name is Amy. If you're returning, welcome back. So this is your weekend message for April 24th to 26th. If you're ready, I'm ready. Let's get going. So we're going to start off your reading with Aries. Everything will be timestamped down below. So you guys can just find your time and or find your sign and then go from there. So let me just timestamp this. Okay. So what I initially feel for you, Aries, is that you're going to be in this, I kind of want to feel like it's a competitive, um, a competitive feeling like it's either you are competing against someone or someone's competing against you, but it's kind of you feeling like you need to protect yourself. You feeling like you need to guard yourself this weekend and getting this energy, like that there might even be some type of disagreement. There might even be some type of conflict. And what's happening is that, you know, I kind of feel like it's like a, he said, she said type argument where you both kind of want to have the last word as well. So I don't know what this energy is, Aries, but I do feel like your best bet right now is to balance out your emotions. Realize that you can't control everything. Realize that some things are better left unsaid. That's kind of the energy that I feel for you guys. I feel like you might be in this place where you could even be harboring feelings. That's what I heard. So I don't know how that resonates with you, but it's in this place where I feel like the need for you to hold back yeah because I feel like people might be coming at you left to right and center and you're gonna have to be able to protect yourself but in a way of understanding that this person is coming after you and I don't mean physically I mean like it's like a spiritual attack or it's some sort of um what, what can I say? Um, emotional attack. That's really what I'm picking up. It's just like whoever this energy is. As things move around my house, that's kind of crazy. But I really feel the need for you to just be very cautious on how you're coming across this weekend, Aries, okay? Um... Because there's a lot of, there's going to be a lot of emotions brewing. This could also talk about your money. So you could be needing to be cautious about your money this weekend, needing to just take that step back and find a balance when it comes to your money. Uh, be careful about those that are coming around wanting handouts from you this weekend. But all in all, I mean, besides that little bit of card there and the disagreement, the conflict, the arguments, whatever that is, we have a lover. So this tells me that you could be coming into union. You could be um, talking with, um, a twin flame scenario. So you could actually, I just heard this. So you could be fighting within yourself when it comes to this connection. You could be this, this person, this divine masculine, this divine feminine, whoever it is, could be walking back into your life or could be coming towards you and it's causing you to put your walls up because that's what I feel I feel like there's a need to find a balance with your emotions this weekend and I feel this sense of com uh, conflicts and arguments so I don't know what's going on with you guys this weekend but you guys need to take care of yourself take care of yourself um, emotionally mentally but I do feel like there is someone coming back with the lovers could be an air sign you guys are dealing with, but, um, there's someone coming back to express. Yeah. Okay. So I'm gonna move along, but that's kind of sort of what I have for Aries for this weekend. So Leo, you are up. So what I have for you guys is that we have the Knight of Cups with the Knight of Swords. So this tells me that you guys also have someone coming toward. <coughs> Sorry, guys. You also have someone coming towards you this weekend. 
this person wants to make you an offer. They know what they want. They're coming in quickly because we also have the Page of Swords and King of Pentacles. So this person has been watching you. You could even have two people coming towards you. It could be Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces, or Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Those are the energies I'm picking up for you, Leo. Okay. So you have um, a good chance of finding love this weekend. Good chance of um, having some type of communication. Someone's coming in quickly for you guys. This this person wants to have some type of communication. This person wants to talk to you because they've been waiting for this opportunity to be with you. But it's about manifesting what it is you right now with the magician. So it's about telling the universe what it is that you need in your life right now. What is it? What it is that you are looking for? I feel like you have the ability to do that. You might even have been calling in your soulmate um before this video like not before but the last couple weeks last couple months you could be really trying to get on board with um bringing love into your life and i feel like this could be that validation that love is coming towards you because a lot of you right now with the eight of cups you're just looking out into the future you're you're really planning ahead you're really getting yourself grounded you're really focused on what it is that you guys want you're not really paying attention to what's in the past anymore you're kind of just moving forward so i feel like as these offers and commitments are coming through this weekend, you're going to be in this place of just what is best for me, what is best for my future, and what is it like I need right now. That's the kind of energy I'm picking up for you, Leo, is that you've been manifesting all the things that you want into your life right now. And it's like you're, you're, what is that thing? You're, uh, it's like it's all becoming. It's like all the abundance, all the blessings is starting to like, rewards like you're starting to reap the rewards of all of the hard work that you've been doing lately um and six of cups right so there has been someone that's watching you i feel like your cups that you, or the seeds that you guys have planted a while back it is starting to grow so that's the rewards i'm talking about i really feel like something's just coming in for you guys this weekend it's definitely love there could be even two people coming in but this person knows what they want they know that they want you um and they're going to make a commitment and they want that family with you so not a bad reading for you guys either okay so sagittarius so sagittarius this weekend i feel a need to tell you that you need to do some rest r and r rest and meditation rest and rejuvenate because with the Four of Swords, I feel like you guys are in your head right now. And then I have the Four of Cups to validate that. So I definitely feel like you guys are in your head about a circumstance or a situation or something like that. You're kind of um, overthinking something, you know. And I feel like that's why you need to go into that rest period. That's why you need to take that break. I feel like Spirit's been trying to offer you a cup. But because you may, you might even be in this place, Sagittarius, but you don't feel worthy of love right now you don't feel worthy of a relationship um so i feel like that's why you need to go within right now that's why you need to take care of yourself um judgment is also here so i feel like you guys are definitely on the right track but i definitely feel and i'm drawn to what someone else has done to you what someone else has said to you that is keeping you feeling like you're not worthy of new beginnings or you're not worthy of new opportunities and it's keeping you feeling um stuck worn down in your head and it's like you're thinking about all the things that you don't have right now instead of thinking about the things that you do have so it's like turning that around and just being grateful for what you do have right now will really help you um yeah rest meditation putting down any worries that you have because he's putting down the sword and just you know just doing you i feel like judgment it could also be talking about leaving things up to karma letting karma handle some issues letting karma deal with what karma does um and just really doing what you need to do for you this weekend okay that's kind of what i have for you guys anyways you guys hopefully that helps hopefully that makes sense you guys take care and i'll see you guys again soon